Hello friends, in this class we will do the nature and scope of operations research. Nature of operations research. First of all, it is based on interdisciplinary team approach. OR problems are formulated by a team of scientists selected from various areas like mathematics, statistics, economics, engineering, physics, etc. They try to analyze the cause and effect relationship between various parameters of the problem and evaluate the outcome of various alternative strategies. So this step, oh, sorry, so uh, this is the interdisciplinary uh, team approach. Okay, a single person cannot uh, no, work on our problems and come to some conclusions. Based on scientific approach, operation research uses techniques of scientific research to find the optimal solutions to problems. It applies scientific methods, techniques and tools for the purpose of analysis and solution of the complex problems. In this approach, there is no place for guesswork and the person, personal bias of the decision maker. Okay, so it is totally uh, scientific in nature, based on holistic approach to the system. It considers the whole system into consideration. It takes into account the interactions among various factors that affect the optimal solution of the problem. So it's not that you leave some important portion of a system. The whole parts of the system need to be taken into consideration based on objective operational research always tries to find the optimal solution to the problem for this purpose objectives of organizations are defined and analyzed these objectives are then used as the basis to compare the alternative courses of action so this was the you know, nature of operation research now the scope the scope of operational research is very wide it can be applied nearly to all fields for solving simple or complex optimization problems. Let's discuss some examples in order to understand the scope of work. Production management. In production management, it's used to determine the optimal product mix, that is, number of different type of items to be produced. In scheduling and sequencing the production run by, by proper allocation of machines. Okay. And in investment management to determine the optimum allocation of funds in different schemes so that the total return is maximum. And uh, yeah, in diet problems, definitely uh, minimum cost balance diets can also be designed with the help of operation research. In marketing management, to determine the best advertisement media with respect to cost, time, etc., to determine the size of stock to meet the future demand. To determine where to distribute the products so that the cost of transportation is minimum. To allocate different marketing executives to different reasons so that the total sale is maximum. So in these areas, in marketing management, operation research has huge scope. In transportation industry, logistics, to produce optimum transportation schedules, to determine the shortest path routes so that the total transportation cost is minimum. And then in defense, to determine the optimum assignment of personnel, to determine the new technology, at, to develop the new technology at optimum cost, to plan strategy of battle, effective 
maintenance and replacement of equipment, inventory control. So in all these areas, operational research has its scope of application. So thank you.